the factories, in the canteens and that sort of thing. And uh, I think people were obliged to put their back into what they were going to do. Designed to boost morale during the Second World War, the slogans of keep calm and carry on and digging for victory are familiar to us all. The sleeping lion began to wake up. He was a pretty drowsy lion for the first six months of the war. Supporting the war effort and encouraging discretion, they were once commonplace. However, a find like this, 150 mint condition propaganda posters, is incredibly rare. The Imperial War Museum said that it's a find of a lifetime, and that's their own words. In 31 years on the Antiques Roadshow, not one was brought in by anybody. Uh, no, I never saw any at all. So, you know, they, they are pretty rare in themselves. They're so disposable, you know, who wants to keep them, really? Well, thank goodness someone did. Hidden in an attic and forgotten about for many years. They're now due to go under the hammer in Lewis next week and expected to fetch around £150 each. The posters certainly capture a very different Britain from today. Have a look at these Careless Talk Cost Lives posters. Keep mum, she's not so dumb. And tell nobody, not even her. Not very politically correct, are they? The image of the, uh, the woman is that of a uh, femme fatale, perhaps, who might give secrets away. The two companion posters caused a lot of uh, uh, upset uh, uh, at the time. People thought that they were very condescending. And also, the sort of class differences, uh, you know, your courage, your resolution will bring us victory. People read a lot into that. So while some belong to another era, others from this exceptional collection could still be considered relevant today. Caroline Faraday, BBC South East Today, Lewis.